Okay, so we would never have breakfast, lunch, and then skip dinner. Mm, Lori Wallace is learning one more quick recipe you could whip up tonight, and then maybe she'll figure out something for the fifth meal. <laughs> like a hobbit. We've been hanging out with Patty all morning, giving you ideas for quick, easy ways to get back into that routine with breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Now the kids are back to school. Shortcuts are my favorite. I do not like at 4 p.m. when I'm sitting there thinking, hmm, what will I make for dinner? So it's it's all about planning ahead. Exactly. You know, statistics show that most people do not know what they're going to make for dinner at 4 o'clock. So <laughs> you're not alone there. So, But I have some, I have some really easy ideas for you and budget-saving tips as well. So um, I, what I did is I started at my favorite Smart and Final store, and again, I'm not buying a ton of ingredients. I'm mm -hmm. reusing things over and over again, but I'm starting with one of their roasted chickens. So I love it because they're, they're super tasty, first off, but there's a ton of chicken on there. So as soon as you get home, take it off the bone, and you've got this for multiple recipes. So I'm going to show you how to make a shortcut enchilada because it's one of my favorites, but it is usually time-consuming. So um, I'm going to give you a little easy tip. So I'm just putting a little bit of enchilada sauce on the bottom bottom of our dish. Okay, and what's great about these two is they can be frozen, so you can yeah. make more than one and put one away for a couple days later. Yep, let, oops, sorry, let the kids mm -hmm. help. I'm just gonna tear my tortillas mm -hmm. and put a layer in the bottom, and if you are kind of watching your carbs, you can you can use a little bit less. I like, like, maybe a double layer. Mm -hmm. And then I've got some of our roasted chicken, and I'm gonna do a lot of cheese. So here's one of your budget-saving tips as well. So you can buy um, a big bag of cheese, which is going to save you some money, especially at Smart and Final if you buy a club size. Private label always. If you really want to save more money, buy a block of cheese and shred it yourself. So you, but use what you have too. If you have cheddar, use it. If you have Jack, use it. If you have Monterey Jack, use it. Use what you have. Don't. The kids will not notice. No, they are not going <laughs> to notice. So, so check your fridge before you go to the store, and and just you know make sure you use everything. Okay, in your this fridge. is a lot faster than rolling each enchilada. I got to say is, that. You know what? Can normally you have to soften them mm -hmm. also in oil and roll, heat up yep. the tortillas and roll them. So I'm sneaking a little nutrition in here, and you're never going to know. The kids are never going to know. I am putting some carrots and zucchini in. I love that idea. Okay, so you just layer that up. That's a great layer one. Yep, yep. And here's what you have. You know, this is fantastic. Mm -hmm. You can't even see the vegetables, which is nice. So once again, I'm putting in some diced green chilies. You can put in onions. Um, if you, I love this big can. I just take it when I'm done and put it in small little containers and stick it in the freezer. Mm -hmm. So I always have these diced green chilies on hand for sandwiches or casseroles. So okay, yeah. and then we have the pasta up here in the front. This is an you easy one, and the kids always love so a little noodle for dinner. Exactly, it's frozen tortellini with an Alfredo sauce and either the First Street or Sun Harvest Organic. The Sun Harvest Organic is a really great way, um, earth friendly, affordable way, if you want to go organic. A little bit of pesto and, and um, marinara sauce. And yeah, it looks th like this is this is for meal, right? when you haven't thought about dinner until 4 p.m. Exactly. You can pull that off. But it's delicious. So then the other thing I did is um, another great bargain is to buy like First Street boneless and skinless chicken breast, grill them. I put it on some um, some cabbage, add some wonton strips, maybe some almonds, and uh, I had a little bit of leftover teriyaki sauce that I grilled it with, and then I'm just going to top it with a prepared Chinese chicken salad dressing. Love so that. Super easy and fast Pl on plan holiday. ahead and get, get things in bulk. Yes. Make it last. Yes. All right, guys, I will send it back to you. Thanks, Lori. Thank you. <laughs>